Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. It is I, not Hayes. We are out front Miami Beach. With Tab Jean. With Tab Jean. It's a nice sunny day. It's currently around like 9.30ish. Today, we don't have much plan except for the beach. The beach. And where are we going today? We're going to, I think it's called Tambourine Mountain or Mount Tam, so sunny. <laughs> Mount Tambourine or something like that. From what I could see, it's like Dandenong area, Dandenong Ranges area or uh, what would it be like? The Oakways. So it's like a town with mountains. It should be good. <laughs> Yeah, so we have that. We're gonna go check out like this mountainous area. Hopefully there's tambourines there. Do you think there's any tambourines? <laughs> yeah, if I don't see one tambourine, I'm gonna be disappointed. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna do like a morning walk around the place. We're not leaving for Tambourine Mountain until like 12-ish. It's 9.30 right now, but yeah. Let's do it. So, Tab and Jean has found herself a rock. What rock did you find? This one. She found herself a... So round and A coin-shaped rock. Yeah. In the yeah, sand. <laughs> next to all the shells. Yeah. She likes to collect rocks. I do. They have to be round and smooth and ideally both. And this is one of them. Yeah. How but she got herself a rock. Let's move, yeah, let's move on. We're gonna get to the peak. All right, we're at the bottom of the point, the lookout point right now. And I got these rocks right here, really cool. Uh, I don't know if it's safe to walk on these. Yeah, there's no signs that say you shouldn't, but look at this. Look at these rocks, wow. Wow. It's cool. Take a look at this. Over here. This is pretty sweet. Oh, there's some deep water right here. In terms of like walking along the coast of the beach. I mean, that's awesome. Oh, it's ankle high the water right now. Oh, look at that. We're now gonna go and climb up. There's like a little tunnel here as well and make like a man-made tunnel here i don't know what's underneath that you can see that there is water draining along here all the way down to the ocean and up here is the peak the lookout people are actually walking up this that's kind of cool you can go up that way and then go around. But people are going up this. What do you think? Should we go up the parkour way that everyone else is, or should we go the normal way? Parkour? In your crocs? Yeah. You're flicking all on me. I am not. made it to the top, the peak of the mountain here at the beach and we found where people were climbing up. So people were climbing up all the way down there up here towards this point. The only issue is, and thank god we didn't do that, how do you get actually up here? There's no actual visible entry here. It's all like locked off so you wouldn't have any way of getting up. So you'll just climb up just to be disappointed and you'll have to climb all the way back down. That's a good exercise. But look at this view. It's an incredible view here. You can also look through this telescope. It costs $2. There isn't really much to see out right now. I would assume 
during different times of the year. You could see maybe boats and stuff. But as of right now, there's nothing here. But man, look at that. You can see all the rocks down there. That's pretty cool. There's Tab and Jean doing something. You have to spend money. I don't have money. I'm poor. <laughs> Look at that. Look at this view. That's absolutely incredible. It's so nice. It's so nice up here. I like it. And we've come at a point where most people were leaving anyway. Maybe they're all leaving because we're vlogging. I don't know. Either way, works out for us. Yeah. <laughs> but. We still need to check out that point right there. So let's keep walking oh. up. Walking. Here we are at point A, the first point that's a little bit higher than the lookout that we were. Let's check this out. Now look at that. That's a nice little walkway to a surface paradise. Is this officially surface paradise on this side? Yeah, yeah. Ah, look at that. That is incredible. A lot more people on this side of the beach. Makes sense, because there's a surface paradise now. I assume. What was it, Nobby Beach? I know there's a beach here called Nobby Beach. Oh. What a wild name, Nobby Beach. just got up the mountain, Tambourine Mountain that is. Uh, it took us a little bit of time to get up here, about an hour, but it was worrying because the car, the little MG car that we've rented here, kind of struggled on the way up. Like it was going 7,000 uh, RPMs at 40 Ks when the speed was 60 on the limit. Uh, so we weren't even reaching the 60 K sometimes, but we did make it, we're here. We haven't had a look yet, but we've had a look. We're very high up. Very high up. This is the red MG I was talking about. This absolute unit brought us up here. It's a small little hatch. I like these type of cars, small little hatches. Uh, but I really did struggle to get up. Maybe next time when we go up mountains, probably something more suitable like an SUV. Or something that has like, I don't know, at least six cylinders would help. I'm actually not too sure how many cylinders. I'm, I'm assuming it's a four cylinder. I don't know, probably. But we're here, let's take a look at the place. So we are here in the mountains. And a little shopping center here. Uh, let's go. So we're at the visitors and so information center here at Tamarine Mountain to figure out where we can go because we have not planned this out at all. We've just rocked up. But there is a map that we can check out that's over here. So we have a map right here. Let me show you all. So we are currently right there. And now if we follow the road up here, we'll head to this national park right here and going up even further is the treetop challenge so the plan that we have right now is to head up check out the national park first go all the way up to the treetop challenge probably do that come back down take a little picnic break around 
either the same national park or we're going to go to the McDonald National Park and that'll be the plan for the day. So yeah, we've got a lot of things to do. Tabongine is inside it, you can see her maybe. She's coming out right now. There she is from the visitor center. So yeah, that's the go to. Place where we want to go, Curtis Falls. Ah, so we're gonna to go to Curtis Falls first. All right. Yeah, I said, closer. okay. That's why. <laughs> I said we're gonna to go to the national park first, and then all the way up to the treetop, and then probably go down to McDonald's National Park yeah. for like lunch or something. Yeah, because yeah. like goes Curtis Falls is just there. Okay, so we're going to Curtis Falls. What's that, Curtis Falls? Waterfall. <laughs> Who would have guessed? Who would have guessed? A place I called Curtis Falls would have. A waterfall but yeah that's our plan so we'll see you when we're at Curtis Falls then first <laughs> stop Curtis Falls yeah we're, we're at Curtis Falls right now we're at the parking area of it there's like a little pavilion over there I assume you can buy drinks foods and all that but we're heading down to the fall. We are going blind, we don't even know where the fall is. We're just kind of walking on the path uh, that seems to lead us there. What are your thoughts? Are you excited for the fall? Yes, I'm excited for the waterfall. Yeah. So the waterfall, the waterfall is somewhere along here. We're gonna follow this path, going into these hedges, these tall ass trees, but we can see Tambourine National Park right there. It's like a secret pathway. So here we are, we're going in. This looks pretty cool. Kinda looks like it's out of a uh, fairy tale. Wow, look at that. You could get lost in here pretty easily. Ah, oh, but there are signs here. So if you go to the left, it's the road access and you go to the right is the Curtis Falls. There's Tab on Jean. Hi. <laughs> well, let's go. Oh, I don't know if you can hear that, but it sounds like water falling from the falls. Oh, wait, look at this. Look at this. <laughs> it looks like a tub. This tree has a built in bathtub. Look at how big that tree is. Jeez. So a built-in bathtub there. You could live in that. Tab and Jean can live in that because she's so short. <laughs> Excuse me. Tab and Jean is going to go into the bathtub now. Do it. Do it. Do it. Wow. Look at that. Very cozy. Look. A little hole there for gnomes. Gnomes and whatnot. Well, let's keep going. getting close oh there's a little bit of wood here to act as a bridge because of how damp or wet this flooring is Ooh. oh got some water coming down from here it's like being on tight ropes it's like being on tight ropes but there it is i see it i see it it's over there the water is gushing down right now, but we are at Curtis Falls. We are at the waterfall itself.
now visited this little street called Gallery Walk. We have a little map right here. Yeah. a lot of cartoons on it so apparently it's like it just has a lot of shops in it and stuff yeah the cafe shops you can get souvenirs from here so we made a little uh, pit stop here it's about 318 right now uh, we're assuming the Sun goes down at 430 so hopefully we can cram everything in but we're gonna check out what we have here right now look at that we have a jewelry studio with tambourine tea. It's the art gallery here. I'm not a big art fan to be to be honest. I'm not the biggest fan of art, but Tab and Jean likes art. And look at that. Art. Wow, look at that. More art. It's birds. I don't know if I'm allowed in with cameras, but there's a lot of art going on in here. I'm just going to wait out here. But yeah, got a little art gallery over here. On the other side, it looks like a fashion. Some sort of clothes store. It's called the Fashion House over there. And then on the other side, we have something called Model Classic or Modern Classic. Yeah, it's Modern Classic. I'm guessing that's also a art store or maybe a clothes store. Some Something. But there's a couple of things here. How was the art gallery? It was really nice. There was this one painting. I couldn't get a video of it because the artist was in there. But it was really colorful and bright and of flowers, so it's really nice. Okay. Well, she she likes art. I I don't know. I don't mind art, but yeah. Oh, there's some tea over there. So we got there's some fruit tea bubble. Is that meant to be bubble tea? I'm guessing. Yeah. Nice bubble, bubble tea. tea. Over here, we, oh, we have some dogs. We have some dogs over here. This is a some sort of restaurant, maybe a cafe, probably a cafe. In all honesty, where you can dine and eat. We've got another clothes store here. You can buy your clothes and little knickknacks. There's some keys on this tree and a little open sign. Oh yeah, you can buy like knickknacks and souvenirs in there. Let's go in and see what we have here. Very, very quaint. Oh, and it's connected to the cafe actually. So the cafe and the knickknack store is connected. And we have Donald Trump right there. Hmm. This is cool. Here you can see. What am I looking at? It's Mickey Mouse. Ho ho! And Popeye. Wow. Oh yeah, got a hats and stuff here. You can get some hats. You can get little knickknacks. A lot of souvenirs here that you can get. Very quaint. You got lights up here. Wow. She's dropped once again her pamphlet. This is like the 20th time I have not recorded all of them because there's just too many to record. Oh, look at that. Popeye game. That's pretty cool. There's some retro stuff here. Pretty neat. Man. Anything you like? Like looking at this kind of stuff. Yeah, soaps in that. There's miniatures. Tab and Jean really loves miniatures. She loves them so much that so she's recording them. <laughs> but yeah, we got soaps over here. And then the cafe. 
you know, honesty, I am more interested in the cafe than I am with the knickknack store. But that's because I like eating food. But when I'm exiting the knickknack store, these are cool. These like uh, towel posters, tea towels with prints. These are cool. But let's check out what else we have on Gallery Road, Gallery Street, whatever. Gallery Walk. Gallery Walk. Gallery Walk. That was close enough. Fudge heaven here, apparently as seen on TV, the best selling fudge since 2004 and out only fresh fudge, ooh, what does that mean? it's probably alcoholic right, so then yeah you can free test the uh, tasting of fudge and a koala over here, <laughs> so we got some fudge here, looks like a little candy store, wow look at that, little candy store here, you can get your fudges and ice cream actually. You can get ice cream here, candy, not bad. So we've got ice cream, we've got smooth macadamia and the boysenberry. Mm -hmm. Test it out. Yeah, right, okay. <laughs> she bites her ice cream and it gives me the creeps. Mm -hmm. She's the type of person that thinks ice cream needs to be ice, yep. rock hard, hard, and I don't know about that. <laughs> but how does the boysenberry taste? It's yummy. Boysenberry is very fruity. I like that. And creamy. Mm. But I want to try the macadamia. The macadamia tastes... I can't even tell you what this tastes like because it doesn't really have that much flavor. It tastes like a mild macadamia nut. I don't know what to say. Yeah, it's, it, try it out, try it out. It's very creamy, the macadamia, but... I know what you mean. It's no got a nutty flavor to it, but it's not necessarily macadamia. Yeah, it's very mild, the uh, nutty flavor of it. But you can tell it's nuts, without a doubt. I like it. It's yeah, good it's good, but like, if you gave me that and I was blind, I would probably say it's just a nut. It's a nut flavor. I wouldn't say it's macadamia. I guess that's where the smooth comes in. The sun is just beaming down on me right now, but we just finished up at Cinnamon Bun Cafe. Couldn't record like live reactions of eating the food because they were playing music. But the Cinnamon Bun, what do you think? I thought it was really tasty. Yeah, I liked it. I, I tasted the Cinnamon Bun and the Pecan. It was really nice. Yeah, I also had the Pecan as well. I liked the Pecan a lot. It was kind of like a mixture of apple pie and a cinnamon or pecan pie. Don't mind the kid almost like getting hit and he, his mum yelling at him. <laughs> but it was pretty good, the pecan pie thing. Um, the cinnamon bun itself, not as sweet as cinnamon if you ever had cinnamon. Uh, not as sweet as a cinnamon. But you can really taste, like you said, the cinnamon. Yeah. And I think that's the main thing. Yeah. You know, because cinnamon can be a little bit too sweet, like for <laughs> Tab on Jean, she can't handle it's it. Definitely a lot sweeter. But like for myself, I can handle it. I love cinnamon. Oh, I froth it, but, you know, it's, it was pretty good for what it was, so yeah. It was really yummy. 
and she also had her uh, chai latte. Chai latte. And I had nothing because I didn't realize everyone was getting something. I just said no. <laughs> what? So I so I was oh. left out. I was left out. I asked you. You, you asked drink. me if I wanted a drink. You didn't say everyone else is getting a drink. Do you want one? <laughs> you asked me if I was if I wanted a drink. Want well, if everyone else was gonna get one, it doesn't matter. Whatever. We're moving on now. It's four thirteen right now. It's almost time for sunset, so we're gonna go to a point. Um, to check out the sunset we we won't have time for the treetop today unfortunately uh maybe next time we come back but we'll have to give that a pass but it's been a long day it's been a long day up in tamarine mountains uh it's very cold now oh, it totally got really cold. we are on a mountain so that's worth noting we are on a mountain that's why it's cold but yeah i'm freezing i didn't bring a jacket but we're gonna head to a vantage point now somewhere to view the, the the sun that's in my face right now. Oh. All right, see you there. All right, everyone, we are nine minutes out, or 10 minutes out, I guess, from the sunset. We found ourselves a spot. We had to park a little bit far, off-road. <laughs> yeah, off but we are now heading to the point where we can see the sunset there's heaps of people here so it's an amazing view from when we drove past yeah you can slowly see it now let me turn the camera around look at that view right now we are very high up clearly on top of a mountain and that view is looking incredible there's the sun right there shining through the trees but here we are we're at the area where everyone wants to watch the sunset. Look at that sun. What a way to end the day. But we're gonna be here until I guess it goes down, until it becomes dark. So I'm very excited. I like sunsets. Yeah. So it's a better time than any to send off. But we're gonna end the video here. I'm gonna have the time lapse or just like a little video afterwards after the ending to play the show of the sunset but if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to like subscribe if you have not and we'll see you in the next one bye like and subscribe <laughs>